Today we're diving into the fastest way to go from one thing to a whole bunch of things in Nomad Sculpt, repeaters. Repeaters will save you hours of work. We're going to cover the three main types of repeaters, arrays, curves, and radials. We're going to cover how each works, when to use them, and how to make them not make your work become a laggy mess. So today I am showing you how to work with repeaters, including arrays, curves, radials. Let's start first with the curves. It's one of those things you may need if you're building out flexies or uh, anything that's sort of segmented and jointed. So we're just gonna create a curve here and you can see it added another spear that is the same size. Now, if we wanted to add additional points, we would just click on our line and you see here it adds additional points. Now, if we wanted to change the count, we would just run through the count here and we could actually then go and move this. So imagine if you were creating a caterpillar flexi, you could use this and you can make some joints in between and same thing, you could add additional points if you want and you can move this spear around. We could also change the radius and we can add more than one radius in here. So for instance, if we wanted this part to be a little bit thicker, we could, you know, and this part to be a little bit thinner, we could do that. We could change our radius. So, and you could bring this all the way up if you wanted. And for instance, you could make a horn. And the more you sort of bring it together, you'll see there's less distance between these spears and you could even, you know, start modifying your shape. So one of the other really cool things is whatever you do to one of these spears, it will affect all the other spears. So for instance, if we just click on the spear and we start creasing it, you'll see the crease starts running up all the spears. So what's nice about that is if you are creating like an articulating item, or in this case, it looks sort of like a horn, I guess, you could actually go and repeat that across the board and it'll modify each of the spears in the array. 